Okay, you guys. So for those of you that don't know, we had a Diamond and Up Leadership Weekend in Dallas. I was only able to go for like 22 hours. So I missed a huge chunk of it. But I went in and we were asked, everyone had to share what they wanted out of the weekend. And what I specifically asked for was, I just want to shake things up, right? So I, I'm like, we just need to like, sometimes things just feel stale, right? In business, in relationships, in motherhood, like, and sometimes we just have to shake up what we're doing. Um, it's not that the business, ha anything has happened in the business. It's things that have happened within us and we just need something new. So I was just like, I just want some new ideas, things that we can do as a team, things that we can, you know, we know host to post is still working. We know follow up and posting all that stuff is still working. It's always working but I just wanted something new. So we are going to be switching up some team things in over the next couple of weeks, but something that was brought to my attention is uh, a little thing called Facebook messenger parties. <laughs> we call them mini Facebook messenger parties. I'm sure we can come up with something way more catchy than that, but I'm really excited to share this with you guys because it's working really well for several teams. I actually heard about it maybe a month or two ago and to be honest, I saw the boards app for it and I got so overwhelmed and I was like, nope, <laughs> that is not going to work. And so I, I just forgot about it. And then when I was at this weekend, one of the other girls had started implementing it and it's going really, really well. Like we're talking, she's had, I think four or five parties and is getting two to five customers per party. So if you would like some of that in your life, you guys can drop a one in the chat. I feel like we have some people that are like, oh, I'll take 20 minutes to sign two to five customers, right? So this is going to be a way that you can launch new distributors. It's going to be a way that you can follow up with potential customers, potential distributors, repeat host to posters. Like there is no limit on this. And I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like and how it's run. I'm going to give you all the boards, apps, scripts, and everything. Um, but you guys, I'm really excited about this. Um, I think the easiest way might be for me to go ahead and just screen share and show you guys what it looks like. But again, all of this stuff is in a board for you guys. So you can run these parties like as of tonight. And so I don't know if my, um, I've got one of my newer distributors. Is she on here? She's not on here just yet, but um, she's doing a party tomorrow night. So I'm going through my first one tomorrow night, but you guys, these can be so quick. There needs to be no preparation, no fancy invitations. You could literally have people host a party for you tomorrow night even though you're just learning it tonight. So it's going to be super fun and I'm excited. Okay. So let me show, I think once I show you, um, it'll make more sense and you guys might be more excited. Um, let me share my screen. Um, I think this might be the easiest way for me to do it. Even though screen sharing is always super delayed. Uh, where is it? Oh, here we go. I'm going to scroll all the way to the top. I know it's probably slow for a second. All right. So I'm going to show you guys an example that I had some um, leaders jump in this group with me earlier today so I can show you guys. I know my notifications are terrible. It's fine. Um, I saw that Jackie in the chat. Okay. So this is what it's going to look like. You guys can title a group chat on Facebook. So I messaged one of my newer distributors and said, Hey, <laughs> you're going to be my guinea pig. We're going to try this thing. I need you to make, I just said, I'll explain in a minute, but just make a list of everyone you've talked to since joining. She's been in for like a month. Okay. So I was like, I need you to just make a list of everyone you've talked to later. I voice, oh, hold on. My phone timed out, but later I voice messaged her and I said, okay, this is what we're going to do. I'm going to do everything for you. All you need to do is invite people. And I, we're going to do a little party in messenger. And she said, okay. So I said, here's a message, send it out to everyone you put on that list. And so she did. And I said, as soon as you've got five or six people that are willing to join the party, let me know and we'll go ahead and get it set up. Okay. So she messaged me when she had several people, I said, great. Um, and so she's been able to add people ever since. Okay. Her party is tomorrow night. The one I just told you about, and this is what it's going to look like. Okay. So I pretended to do a party for this girl, Jill, Jill invited her, or this is Jill's launch party. Okay. Jill invited her friends to this little messenger party. Okay. When they said yes, she added them to this group chat and 
I'm doing all the work. Okay. I'm sending all the messages and I'm telling Jill on the side that, Hey, when people say they're interested in something, all you're doing tonight is writing their name down and writing next to it, what they're interested in. Okay. I was like, that's your only job. If you want to interact in the chat, great. But your job is to keep track of who's interested in what. Okay. So this is just an example. You guys don't have to read all of this. I just kind of want to show you how it's going to go. Okay. So the day before the party, you're sending them this list. You can change the list. If you have someone really interested in skincare, I don't have messages for that just yet. So I left that off the list. Um, but you guys can tweak this as you see fit or as whatever you're passionate about. Okay. So they're going to pick the numbers that they're excited in the day before the party or the morning of the party. And then I'm just going to send some reminders leading up to the party. And then they're going to say hello to be entered for a giveaway. You guys, you can choose what you want to do for a giveaway. I'm doing a pack of skinny brew or a pack of sleepy tea for my giveaway at the end. Okay. If they have five people come to the party and interact. Okay. Um, so it looks like this. And then I just go through the numbers that they picked. So you guys can choose all of these scripts are in the boards app but I went through all of them. Okay. So in this party, I've, this is just an example of me going through all of them and not every product, but just the numbers that I shared above. Okay. So hair, skin and nails. I did lash serum, energy sticks. People can ask questions. It's interactive. Some of the, some of the messages have questions. Um, and this is great, you guys. So if you're newer, your sponsor can help you do this or anyone in your upline can help you do this and they can do the messages and help you answer the questions. Guys, if you've been in for a while and you have a newer distributor, this is how you're going to teach them to talk about the products because people are going to ask questions and you're going to show them how to answer, right? Okay. So you're teaching them how to talk about the products authentically and share the information. They're also learning about the products as you do this. Okay. Um, so before and after pictures, um, and then Okay, so there's like a little video they can watch about slimming gummies, TFX. Okay, so there's like interactive posts, just like our, our heart host to post. Okay, just to get people talking in the chat, we tell them the more you interact, the more chances you'll have to win. Um, go through all the different types of coffee. So this is what the party looks like. And then you can put information about the business opportunity. Okay. This is actually a video from someone else. I have not watched it. I just wanted to show you guys an example. Um, so you can have your own video that you insert right there. It should be pretty short and sweet. Um, or you can use one of ours or this one here. Okay. Um, I actually put a few of these out of order. They are in order in the boards app. Um, but then I picked a winner for the giveaway. Okay. This part will actually be in a different order, but you're going to tell them about the pick two, pick three sale, ask them what two or three products they would choose. Okay. So you've already got them probably interested in a few different products. They're going to comment with what products they're interested in. You're going to explain the loyal customer program. And then at the end of the party, after you've announced the giveaway winner, okay, if you're doing a giveaway, you're going to help your distributor reach out to the people with what they're interested in. Okay. All of those messages are also in the board that I'm going to share with you guys tonight. Everything from sending out the invite to setting up the party to, um, sending the, the product info, the before and afters, literally everything I just showed you, you guys, besides a few questions that I answered throughout the party, everything is in the board. You just have to follow the numbers. Okay. And then you can tweak as you need to, you can copy all of the buttons if you want and make them into your own folder, if you want to, and then edit them. Um, like if you have your own personal result photos, that would be a really good idea to, to edit some of the, the keys to have your personal results. Um, but that that's the party you guys. Okay. So I'm going to show you the board really quick, just to walk you through it. Um, I will share the link here in the chat. So the board is called Facebook mini parties. I will probably put it in our success board also, but I'm going to share just this board with you guys too. Um, so it talks about what a Facebook mini party is, um, how to get a new distributor, like the whole process of this is how you're going to, what you want to do. This is what we're going to do to get it. Here's how you're going to get people to the party. Here's what we're going to do when you get people to commit to the party. Step by step, everything is in here, you guys. And I cannot take credit for like 99% of it. <laughs> I have pulled this from Jamie Whitehead and a different leader and then just kind of filled in the gaps. So um, there's messages for inviting people. 
So here's the thing. Even if you don't have a new distributor right now, there's no reason you can't do this with either an existing distributor or downline. There's no reason you can't do a party of your own, like just host it for yourself. And there's no reason you can't reach out to people and ask them to host a party for you. They don't have to be in the business. It can be anyone. It could be a current customer that loves the products. It could be a person that always hosts the post for you. That's what Lauren um, was. I think Lauren and Lydia were talking about is think of those people that host the post for you every single month and they don't want to do the business or they don't want to, they already use the products or they don't want to use the products or maybe they don't have the money. This is a great follow-up tool of like, hey, give me 20 minutes of your time, invite five to 10 people. If you get a few people to show up, I'll do a giveaway at the end. And then if you want to incentivize them with like, hey, if I get two or more orders from your party, I'll send you whatever. It could be a, a pack of skinny brew. It could be energy stick samples, whatever you guys have or want to send. Some people will probably just do it out of the goodness of their heart for you. <laughs> um, but because they're a messenger, because they're short and sweet, because they're interactive, um, they've been going really, really well for people. So I'm really excited to get some of these booked. And you guys, I reached out to my newer girls and they were both like, all right, let's do it. Like, why not? And so they're just going back to the people from their chicken noodle soup list, back to the people that didn't have the money. And again, just writing them all down and then we're inviting them. And so the invite message is in, um, is in the board as well. I'm going to put that in the chat right now before I forget to give you guys that link. And then I also typed up a few of my own messages today that I'm going to share in here. So one of the things that I'm going to be doing tonight is reaching out to my old potential distributors, like people that didn't sign up when it was like $49 and people that aren't signing up for $149, like the people that are just like, all right, <laughs> I'm, I'm done with you finally. Like, I don't think you're going to join, but I'm going back to those people and just saying something like what I just put in the chat, which I realize is kind of long, but basically saying, I know you've been interested, hasn't been the right time. I have an idea. Let's do this. If you have a few people that want to order, I'll either send you a free gift or you can sign up and you can make commission on their orders instead of me. And let's just try it. Okay. So, um, I'm going to run that by all of my PDTs. Um, I'm going to end it with a question. Like, are you free for 20 minutes on Tuesday or Wednesday? And just see what happens. Um, and not leave it up in the air of like, Hey, would you ever do this for me? I'm just being like, I've got free time at eight and nine on Wednesday. What do you think? So you guys, you can use this party tool for anything. And so we always, um, you know, in the past, we've been able to, we're not really a party company, but we've been able to meet with people in person, face to face. And we've been able to get in front of three or four people at once. And when you can have that more interactive time with a small group, you can spend less time and get more orders than talking to a bunch of people one-on-one -on -one through Messenger. So I'm really excited about this. I hope you, I hope I explained it well enough that you guys are excited about it. I think when you start clicking through the board, you're going to get excited about how much of it's already done for you. And now your job is just to find people that will host for you and to help some of your distributors launch or relaunch their business this way. And just have anyone that's, I mean, I guess they can invite their current customers too, but have anyone that they've ever talked to and invite them to one of these parties or ask them to host a party for them and have these, have these going all November and December long. So, um, sorry, got a text message. Do you guys have any questions? I'm waiting for the chat. I told you it was going to be super short and sweet. I just wanted to share. And I'll share this. Some of these are in the boards, but just so you guys can see. Perfect. Yeah. And if you guys, um, trying to think of the best way to no, you guys can see all the messages in the boards app. So I don't need to do that. Um, yeah. So for four and one, you have until 1210, but for 
parties and making money and doing getting getting all the customers and all that you have until forever. But yeah, for four and one, if that's what you're asking, is till twelve ten. But I would just encourage you guys to get excited about it. Let this be a little spark for you. Do one this week. That would be my encouragement, whether you have one person or 10 people agree to come to the party, whether it's you hosting it for yourself or you hosting it for your mom or hosting it for one of your DTs, put one on the books because they're so easy. It's all done for you. All you have to do is find a 20 minute window and then just do it and make it fun and edit it as you go. If you need to, like for the people that were in the mock party earlier, like I was going through it and I was having to change things as I went and it should be pretty good for you guys now, but there were just some things that were left off. Um, but it was fun and it was so simple and you guys could be doing that while you're doing something else. I mean, truly it's all, it's all there. So really, really excited about it. Any other questions? Because I have one little challenge I'm going to give to you guys. So I'm going to give everyone in here until 10 PM. Your goal is to get a party booked tonight in the next hour and message me when you've got someone agreed to do a party. And I'm going to send someone 50 bucks just for booking a party in the next hour. You can use all the messages in the boards. All you have to do is get one party booked because that's how much I think that these are going to be a game changer. If you are a new distributor and you're on here and you set up your party, that counts. <laughs> and you message your sponsor and say, Hey, I want to do one of these Facebook parties. If your sponsor doesn't know what in the world they're talking, you're talking about, they weren't on this zoom, obviously. Um, but they can message me or you can message me and I will help you get one set up. If you are on here and you help one of your new distributors or existing distributors, set up a party that also counts. So there's, there could be some double dipping going on if a new distributor. So you guys just have to send me a confirmation of your party date and time confirmed. Okay. Preferably this week, but it doesn't matter. Okay. So if we get one person to schedule a party, that person automatically gets 50 bucks. Um, but as many people and as many parties as we can get booked in the next hour, try to get one booked before you go to bed tonight because this, I really feel like is going to be a little spark that a lot of us need. And a lot of us are going to benefit from greatly over the next couple months. So that's it. That's all I had to share with you guys tonight. I know I usually can, I blab and talk on and on and on, but I'm not going to do that tonight. I'm just going to share the link to the board one more time. Um, or maybe yeah, I did share, it. I did share it. Make sure you guys get this. I will post it on the team page and share it in the chat as well. Um, Brandy, like I said, I just reached out to my distributor and I was like, hey, we're going to do this. Make a list of people that you, <laughs> you've talked to so far. And then as soon as they did, I said, okay, this is what we're going to do. It's working really well for some top leaders. Let's start a group chat. I didn't even walk through anything more than that. I was like, I'm going to do everything. All you have to do is show up and get the people added to the group. So just keep it short and sweet would be my recommendation. Um, and then my other rec my one last tip for you guys, just to fill up some empty, awkward silence is that like for my party tomorrow night, I asked Courtney Boyd, I don't know if she's still on here, but I asked, ask someone in the business already, or ask your sponsor or ask a sideline to be in the chat with you for your first party. So that way they can be interacting too. They can act like a potential customer. They can just be in there to engage, but it does help to have some extra activity just to kind of have someone in there asking questions, like easy questions questions like, is the cleanse going to make me run to the bathroom? Just like little stuff like that, um, because it'll help the other guests feel more comfortable asking questions. So when you get your first party or two set up, ask someone if they want to be in the party there, you know, interacting and, and stuff in the chat. So, um, Amber, honestly, I don't think that's going to happen. You talk to people all the time about the products and I mean, <laughs> I feel like you're going to be just fine. And if it's something like a medical thing, I mean, you know, our answer is always like, we always suggest that someone asks their doctor. I feel like that's going to be the one question that people might get in the chat where there is like not an answer or that we don't feel comfortable. It's just, you know, we always, I can send you the ingredient list on the side. Um, that would be my other thing is I would say, Hey, can you message me privately after the party so that we can talk about it? 
So, because there are some parts of the party where it says, um, you know, if you're not comfortable sharing, message me privately, or you can message me privately. So I would just handle it that way. That'll at least give you some extra time to ask questions to someone behind the scenes and be like, this person asked me this, what do I do? <laughs> but yeah, I wouldn't stress too much over that. You guys, um, if you come across a question that you don't know, either your sponsor might be in the chat with you. If they're not, um, just be honest with the person like, Hey, I don't know. Let me look after the party. I'll find out for you. And that usually is sufficient. Uh, well, Hey, people booking parties. I see it in the chat. Um, you guys just shoot me. I mean, if you have my phone number, you can text me. If you want to Facebook me, if you guys get parties booked in the next hour, those ones that you guys just got totally count. Um, but just message me with, you know, a screenshot or day and time or whatever of your party, just to verify. And then I will draw a winner tomorrow. And that's it. I'm going to go book some parties too. I hope you guys are excited about this. I hope you got the boards app link. I am, I am going to post it on the team page. I will get this recording up. I know the recording was not necessarily anything special, but just so people have an idea of what in the world we're doing with this board and how it's going to run. Um, and that's it. So thank you guys for being on, get really excited about this, get your newbies really excited about this get people relaunched with this that maybe either didn't get their business going or did and then life happened. Use this as a way to spark some energy back into some people. All right, guys, talk to you later.